Hello, my name is Josiah Ray. I'm going to show you how to add a border to text or objects or whatever you're looking at inside of Microsoft Publisher. So here I am inside of Publisher. I'm just going to start typing some, some random text here, just to kind of get a few multiple lines. And you'll notice this pop-up that says, if it's too hard to see, then I can push F9. So let's, let's test that out. Hey, look at that, I can see it again. So I'm going to come up to this top area. And you can see that we've got this fill color, and we've also got line color. So I'm going to select kind of like a, a red-orange line color. But it goes around this entire box. Publishers kind of created this text box for me to type in that's the size of the page. I really only kind of want that text to be bordered around. So I'm going to zoom back out here, pushing the, the zoom out button up top. And we can grab the, the little circles along the edge of this. I'm going to scale that down. And you'll notice that it doesn't really keep its aspect ratio, but that's fine. And I'm going to push F9 again, automatically zoom back in, same little feature. And right next to the, the font color, we've got this line slash border style. So we can click on that, and we've got a whole bunch of different styles that we can choose from. We can go into some more advanced stuff. All I want to do, though, is make this a little bit bigger. So let's select a size that's a little bit bigger. And there you can see our border's a little beefier around the text. It's nice for creating any kind of a publication or a magazine front when you want the text to have a border around it. I'm also going to insert this object real quick, just a, just a square. So let's draw a square. And I'm going to fill it blue, because I really like blue. And we're also going to select the line color. Uh, let's see. Let's do yellow. And you can't really see it, again, because Microsoft defaults to the really, really small lines. So I'm going to, real quick, increase the line like we saw before. And now you can see I've got this blue box with a gold border around it. So I hope you've enjoyed this video on how to create borders around text and objects in Microsoft Publisher. I'm just Ray.